I'd say there's potential. Hey now, you're an all-star. Get your game on, go play. Hey now, you're a rockstar. Get the show on, get paid. And all that winners is gold. Only shooting stars. You're watching AHS Today. Good morning, Auburn High School. It's Monday, September 14th, a blue day. I'm Carly Sellers. And I'm George Johnson, and you're watching AHS Today. Let's see what's for lunch with Austin and Ada. Ada, you want to come eat hot dogs, fish nuggets, and chicken taco soup with me in the cafeteria? I was actually thinking about going to lunch with you today, but not when you're wearing that. I thought this would make you laugh. No. Juniors. If you have paid your dues online, you may come by room 814 or 808 to pick up your class t-shirt. If you have not paid and want to pay by check or cash, you can come before or after school and see Ms. Searcy in room 814 or Mr. Leonard in room 808. All juniors and seniors planning to participate in the Youth Senate Scholarship should sign up with Ms. Yeager by tomorrow. The exam will be held on September 17th during the third period and only registered students may attend. Visit their website for more information. Attention seniors, Christina Bain from Oglethorpe University will be here today at 10 a.m. to meet with interested seniors. This recruitment event will take place in the multimedia room and Mr. Tindall will take attendance at the event. Let's take a look at today's weather. Good morning Auburn High School, I'm Rushton Davis here with your weather. Today is going to be a high of 83 and a low of 63 with a 0% chance of rain. And tomorrow is going to be just as sunny with a high of 82 and a low of 64. Back to you in the studio. The AHS Key Club will hold its first meeting of the year tomorrow from 3.30 to 4 in the multimedia room to discuss club and membership volunteer opportunities. If you can't attend the meeting but are interested in the club, please stop by Ms. Foster's room 832 before or after school to pick up an informational flyer. There will be a parent meeting tomorrow at 7 p.m. in the AHS Multimedia Room to discuss the golf program and upcoming dates. Seniors, Elizabeth Hawthorne from Furman University will be here tomorrow at 2 p.m. to meet with interested seniors. This recruitment event will take place in the Multimedia Room and Mr. Tindall will take attendance at the event. Design Club will meet in Mr. Cox's room right after school tomorrow. Everyone is invited. Now let's go to Catherine and Mary Claire with the highlighter. Hey, and welcome back to The Highlighter. I'm Mary Claire Breland. And I'm Catherine Neal, and we're inside of a classroom at Auburn High. Are y'all ever just like us and want to get out of here? And make a little money while you're at it? This week, we're highlighting Auburn High School's co-op program. Let's go check it out. Hey, I'm Julie Mann, and I'm a junior, and I'm in co-op. And I just think it's a great opportunity so you can get um, an early start on your work experience. Students enrolled in Auburn High School's work-based education program, formerly known as co-op, have a unique opportunity to earn high school credit while participating in jobs related to their chosen career path. As a participant in the WBE program, students will build a career portfolio, gain work experience, and learn invaluable organizational, time management, and goal setting skills that will help them to become valuable employees. Interns and apprentices of the program are responsible for working a minimum number of hours each week. They're also uh, required to submit assignments uh, designed to increase their overall quality as a potential employee. As the coordinator, it is my desire to guide students to promote them in developing experiences that will meet their goals as being college and career ready. If you would like more information about the co-op program or the work-based education program, please visit my website at www.auburnschools.org backslash a marshall. That's it for this week. We'll see you next week on the Highlighter. Back to you in the studio. Anyone interested in Science Bowl should attend a meeting at 7.30 a.m. on Thursday, September 17th in room 302. French Club will have a meeting on Thursday, September 17th at 325 in room 9101 to discuss ideas about the Homecoming Festival and the Eric Vincent concert. Please bring your $25 dues to this meeting to cover your French Club t-shirt and take it to the concert. This club is open to all Auburn High School students. If you have any questions, please contact Madam Ox. 
Tickets are on sale now in the athletic office for Friday night's varsity football game against Enterprise. Tickets are $7 and will be available Monday through Thursday from 7.30 a.m. to 4.30 p.m. and on Friday from 7.30 a.m. until noon, as well as at the game. The Pink Out the Duck Breast Cancer Awareness Night will be October 30th. Please see Ms. Osborne in room 307 or a host member to pre-order a Pink Out the Duck shirt. Shirts are $7 for a small through extra large and $1.50 extra for plus sizes. Please pre-order before October 16th and shirts must be paid for when you order. Now let's go watch the administration ambush Ms. Lundy. Miss Lundy, oh, we have a special announcement to make. What is it? We are here to let you know that you were nominated for the Herman Moore Lamp Award for Exceptional Service with the Alabama Library Expo. And not only were you nominated, but you have won. Yay! Yay! <laughs> and you will be honored at a reception on September 29th. Oh. In Montgomery. Yes. So, yay! yay. We appreciate you. Thank you. Mr. Sinclair is looking for students who would like to display their talent during our 2015 2016 courtyard jams. No talent is too small or too odd. We will have courtyard jams starting at 7 30 for a football away games and throughout the year to celebrate other AHS sports and events. Now, let's go see what's going on in the AHS library. So let your So come to the Media Center and get connected. Tiger TV would like to wish a happy birthday to Mr. Cawthorn. Good luck to the volleyball team tonight against Central. Thanks for tuning in. That's AHS Today. Please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance and observe a moment of silence. 